Today, I am going to be dissecting a shoot apical meristem of a coleus plant. Coleus plants come in green and purple varieties, and I will use a more purple plant for this dissection. The shoot apical meristem is a region of undifferentiated dividing cells from which the entire shoot, including new plant organs, develop. Shoot apical meristems are located at the tip of a shoot and can be visualized under a compound microscope by the dome of darkly staining cells. The purpose of this dissection is to visualize a living shoot apical meristem and, in doing so, gain an understanding of its size and position on the plant. In addition, you might be able to get a general sense of the developmental stages of leaves as they are removed from the shoot. The materials needed for this dissection include a coleus plant, a razor blade, forceps, a dissecting scope, and although I do not use it in this video, some may prefer a scalpel to remove leaves. To perform this dissection, first, a razor blade will be used to remove the tip of a growing shoot. I generally cut two to three inches from the tip to have enough room to hold it while performing the dissection. Then, before going under the dissecting scope, gently remove any large, fully or mostly developed leaves. If you plan on performing this dissection yourself, here are some helpful tips. I found that using forceps for the entire dissection prevented the tissue from turning brown quickly, which made it hard to see the shoot apical meristem in what you were doing. Remember that the leaf phyllotaxis of the coleus plant is opposite and decussate. Opposite meaning that two leaves come off the plant at the same time across from each other, and decussate meaning that the next pair of leaves will be positioned perpendicular to the previous pair. Now let's get started. Now, because of the plant's opposite and decussate leaf phyllotaxis, I am rotating the shoot by 90 degrees to see the next pair of leaf primordia on either side. Once again, I am rotating the shoot. Although this might look like a complete dome, by a gentle poke, you can see the pair of leaf primordia separate. I do not remove the entire right leaf on the first try, but I will come back after the left leaf to get the rest of it. Now we have reached the shoot apical meristem. I am gently touching the shoot apical meristem to point it out. Now I'm going to rotate the shoot so we can see the shoot apical meristem from the other direction. You might have noticed that the shoot apical meristem looked more like a dome before we rotated it 90 degrees. This is because the very beginnings of the next leaf primordia have been initiated and can be seen as small outcroppings on either side of the shoot apex, appearing like a little Mickey Mouse head. There isn't just one shoot apical meristem on each plant. There are dozens, hundreds, potentially thousands of meristems on any one plant. They form our crops, huge trees, and all the diverse plant forms of the world. Who knew our lives and the lives of so many living things rely on something as small as a shoot apical meristem? <laughs>